Why would they do this? Why are they trying to hide the fact that we are on an infinite plane uh, or on a flat earth rather than a ball? Well, if you isolate people into the idea that they're on a blue marble that's in the middle of a universe that is really insignificant and there's thousands of millions and billions of other worlds and possibly other civilizations, that makes most people think that we are insignificant and that we did actually come about as some sort of an accident. Now, when people believe that, their minds are much more malleable into being given the idea that there is no God, there is no creator, and because of that, that also gives the controllers this fertile soil to build other deceptions on. It's about total control, mental, physical, spiritual, every way, shape, form possible. You have to remember how big of a conspiracy this is. This isn't talking about just the JFK thing or isn't talking about just 9-11. It's on an umbrella kind of system to where it is the biggest deception that there is. It actually exposes every other deception and nothing else brings down the power of the elite because it really exposes education, science, the economy, television, museums, universities. Think of all the things that have been fooled. I feel worse for the people that are out there building satellites, the people that are out there actually working for these space agencies, the people out there teaching in schools as professors, because they would all come to the conclusion eventually, once this gets out, that they've all been contributing to the lie. This is why you have to ask questions. The Earth spins at a thousand miles per hour at the equator and travels around the sun at 70,000 miles per hour. And the sun travels through the galaxy at 450,000 miles per hour. That's eight trillion miles the sun has traveled since the year zero. Over a light year. And yet for thousands of years even before that, people were looking into the sky and seeing the same stars that we see today. And if they had the same optics that we have today, they'd be able to photograph perfect star trails, just like we can. 